What's going on YouTube? Welcome back to another video. And in this video today, I'm gonna to be talking about the reason why I started doing uh, YouTube. Now, there's a couple of reasons why I did, but first, before we get into this video, make sure you subscribe to the channel, hit that bell notification. Also, uh, like the videos, watch all the videos if you will, you know, and uh, also leave a comment in the comment section because I'm trying to engage a little bit more with my uh, audience or people that watch my uh, videos. and. Know, just have a little casual conversation, you know, here and there, you know. Or if you got any questions about anything, you know, just feel free to ask, you know. Or if you can't get in touch with me on there, you can also follow me on uh, Instagram, scat underscore pack underscore J. So, but without further ado, let's get to it. One of the main reasons I started doing YouTube, you know, when I got this car, because, you know, as a lot of y'all know already, this was a car you know, wanted for a long time. And I said, if I wasn't able to start, you know, with a Hellcat, I was gonna go with the uh, 392. So I was always gonna choose the Challenger over, or the Charger over the Challenger, you know, for that specific reason. Plus me, personally, I think the Chargers look better, you know, as far as style, because it's like, the Challenger's kinda, you know, it's like ever since they, you know, brought them back out, it's like they've been, they look the same, you know. They really haven't even, you know, really changed much. You know, I mean, they changed a few aesthetics here and there, like the headlights and the tail lights, you know, and stuff like that. But I don't know, I just, it just all looked the same to me. And the Chargers, you know, they, you know, look a little bit more stylish than the uh, Challengers. And I also, and I want to use the YouTube platform to kind of, showcase that or you know share my experience with other people and get feedback on you know what my should be done or this and that you know basically trying to you know start a community or a conversation on you know this type of car and get other ideas of what other people may think you know just kind of let's all grow together with this because I never had a car that I actually got got to do modifications with to the extent that I wanted to do them, you know. You know, with the decals, the tire lettering, you know, wrapping it, and, you know, changing out spoilers, wheels, you know, all that good stuff. You know, I never had that chance to do that to one of my vehicles. And I figured this vehicle would be one, you know, a very good one that, you know, people would actually like to see. Just sharing, you know, my overall experience of even just having this car, doing the mods and all that good stuff, you know, with people, you know what I mean? Because right now this car is, a, is very popular, you know, these cars are everywhere, not just, you know, in the town that I'm in. It's also popular, you know, pretty much nationwide. And a lot of people got them. You know, whether it be a Scat Pack, a RT, a Hellcat, or a GT, SXT, ooh, ooh, wee wee, you know, all that. They just everywhere. As far as the YouTube channel, I mean, a lot of y'all don't know. You know, it was, it was kind of hard in the beginning because of what was, you know, going on in my life. Not just with me, but loved one and you know doing this kind of just kept me sane you know what I mean like kept me kind of thinking positive and not thinking negative you know a lot because you know I noticed for a second you know I, I never really talked about it, but you know some things you know starting to get to me but it's like you know doing this YouTube thing or, you know, trying to come up with video content and all that, it's like, you know, it kind of kept me thinking about something other than what I was really thinking about, you know what I mean? So, I mean, it had helped me out, you know, it's opened my mind a little bit more than, you know, than it was. It kind of gives me something to look forward to, you know, as far as being, you know, more creative in what I do. 
know, motivating other people, inspiring other people, you know, because it's not just all about me, it's not just all about the car, you know, I also want to, you know, share my experience with other people as well. And, you know, I think, you know, people that may have want, that may want this video, you know, that may be kind of afraid to go out there and get it or start the process of getting one, they're really not going to, you know, they need to see someone with one that may be going through some of the same things they're going through in order to, you know, kind of give them clarity on, you know, whether they should take that leap of faith or not. Because, I mean, at the end of the day, you know, yeah, you gotta have money to afford one of these, but, you know, you don't have to be the richest person in the world because really this car is not that expensive, you know. I think I, I said another video, I mean, if you're making at least, you know, well, I said at least 50,000, but 40,000, you know, 45,000 would do. And you divide that by however, you know, by 12 months, you know, and that'll give you your number. And then you can go from there and figure out, okay, can you still pay your bills? Can you still do this and still maintain this vehicle, you know? I mean, that's another way of looking at it. I ain't saying that's the only way to look at it, but it's just another way of looking at it. And also, you know, being in this vehicle, doing YouTube, it, it kind of feels, it kind of feels natural, you know, especially when like I'm doing the video right now, just sitting in the car, you know, I'm comfortable, it's just, it just feels kind of natural. And to those of y'all that, you know, know me or see me on other platforms, you know, I'm not camera shy, I've, you know, I've been online, you know, for quite some time, so it's not, this is not nothing new being on camera. I'm not camera shy, you know. It's just, I think it's just hard just trying to actually find something to talk about, especially when it's just you and the camera just sitting here. Like my wife agreed to come with me, you know, to do this video, but I feel like, you know, I have to be alone in order to really, really, you know, come out with everything, you know. I'm not saying I don't want her company, it, it just feels more natural when I'm sitting here by myself and I'm talking to the camera, which is the way I'm talking to you all. But so far, I've enjoyed it. You know, I put out 13, 14. I think this will be the 15th video. I might be wrong. But, uh, you know, I put out some videos. Like I said, I'm still on that, you know, thing about uploading the video every, uh, or three times a week. Now, I don't have a specific day that I'm going to upload them on, but I'm still trying to be consistent at doing at least three videos a week. And right now, you know, it would have been another type of video, but as you can see, it's raining. Ain't much you can really do in the rain, so that's why I'm doing this video like this. Because I really wanted to do the, uh, I really wanted to take my mom for a ride. I called her earlier to see if she wanted to do a review. But, uh, Rain and you know, you really won't get the full effect of you know what it's really like, you know, for somebody else to drive if you can't really drive it, you know, how you want to. But you know, it's also you know, it's also helped me connect with different people, you know, being on YouTube, and I also get to watch the process of these, you know, other people, you know, with their vehicles and going through, you know, whether it's from them buying one or or even doing modifications to their vehicle and a few of them, you know, and I like to watch the ones that are just starting out like me, you know, that don't have very many subscribers, you know I like to also support those you know, YouTubers as well and it also, you know, it helps motivate them too at the same time and on their journey, you know also you know motivates me you know like okay I'm not the only one out here that just you know they can do it you know there's other people out here just starting out like me you know but they starting out with the same car or a little different car you know it's you know it's just interesting to see and we can all kind of you know we're using the same platform we're all you know kind of growing together who knows you know we might even you know meet up one day you know I am also a part of a car club now. 
so you know you'll be you'll start to see some of that content you know and i think you know once once these holidays are over everything is gonna you know you start to see a lot more than what you're seeing on the channel right now you know because at the time i got this vehicle okay it was you know coming up on halloween you know and then thanksgiving right behind that and then you know christmas which was just the day before you know so everything is just kind of you know jam-packed into one but uh you know slowly but surely you know you'll start to see a lot more on this channel not just my car you know you'll start to see other people's car you know guys from the uh, my car group you know you start to see some of their cars and you know one of them look way better than mine you know well a couple of them but uh gonna be a versatile channel you know we're gonna be doing different cars and i'm also still you know get into doing some uh car reviews because i do have to go ahead from the dealership where i got this vehicle from to start doing uh reviews on the cars that they got up there so you know be on the lookout for that but it's you know as far as that part go i mean it, it would be kind of difficult to do because of my work schedule you know i work day and night Day, you know, days and nights so even on the weeks that I work days I don't get out till six o'clock and it's dark by the end and the dealership getting ready to close so can't do much there and also when I work nights and I'm off during the morning you know I may have some things to do or maybe other video ideas other than doing a car review so you know I'm kind of making this up as I go on you know just trying to stay focused you know come up with a plan for 2020 and execute because I really do want to grow this channel and just you know be able to do some things that I've never done before you know and show my kids that you know my kids love cars so you know that'll be you know a nice community that they can go in and experience and see what's all out there and hopefully they'll be motivated to you know get whatever it is car that they want you know and work hard for it and you know just keep going up and up you know don't get stagnant you know don't just settle for what you can get I mean just you know in these times right now everybody has pretty much the same resources available to them so there's you know really in this point in time there's really no excuse to say why you can't make it you know we got there's so many millionaires these days being made than there ever has been. And it's all about, you know, stepping out on faith, going for what you really want, and just being consistent. And, you know, just really, you know, having a passion for something and just sticking with it. You know, people get stuck here, you know, get stuck in one spot for so long and they don't know how to get up out of that one spot because that's all they used to. I mean, it happens, you know, and you know, I was in that mindset before, you know, but now I see that there's a whole lot more possible, you know, possibilities out here than just what I knew. So, it's time to, you know, just, you know, give it a try and see what, you know, see what happens, you know, at least give it a try. Some people are too scared to give it a try. And, those people that are scared, them the ones that become the haters of the people that actually step out on, you know, step out of their comfort zone and try to make some of themselves. So, I just pulled back up to the driveway. I should have been going to the gas station. I don't know why I did. But anyway, I hope y'all enjoyed this video. Those, my, you know, a few reasons why I started doing YouTube. And, you know, I take the, I plan on taking this channel to, you know, to another level or doing you know a lot of things on this channel with the car and you know with other cars and letting y'all see some other people that's out there you know in the car community and you know just kind of maybe pick back off them and their experiences and all that good stuff so uh, anyway like comment subscribe hit that bell notification it's your boy scat pack j and i'll catch you on the next one. peace